horror movies are definitely one of the best movie genres to ever exist. And today in this video, we're going to show you the top 5 horror movies of the last 5 years. So sit back, relax, and enjoy the video. Or don't and get scared. Number 5, It Follows. Whether perceived as a parable of the dangers of unprotected sex in the age of AIDS and pandemics, or a proclamation of reclaiming control of life and sexuality amid those sorts of dangers, or even as more broader concept of simultaneous risks of intimacy and isolation in the modern hyper-connected world, it's undeniably great filmmaking. The relentlessness, a personal nature of the central conflict, makes it most of all a story simply about death's inevitability, however hard we fight to delay or deny it. And that is ultimately why it resonated so strongly with audiences. That, and it's scary as hell. Costing just $2 million to produce, this movie more than covered expenses, even with an extremely modest $18 million theatrical coomb. Daydream about being old enough to go on dates. I had this image of myself holding hands with a really cute guy, driving along some pretty road. It's never about going anywhere, really. Number 4, A Girl Walks Home Alone at Night Sensual shades of black and gray mingle to a hip western score for a vampire romance by way of Dead Man and Rumblefish. Few directors in horror have a freshman outing as perfect as this, and it's brilliant that the bloodletting is of secondary importance to the main characters and arcs woven throughout the film. With a micro budget, the film had a limited release and only took just under $500,000, but it received almost universal critical praise, as well it should and is building quite a following on home entertainment among horror fans. Number 3, The Conjuring. Supposedly based on a true story, but of course, none of it is seriously true, it's old school haunted house cinema extraordinaire. There is an instant timelessness to the proceedings and a visual texture that is John R. Leonetti's career best. If you want to ensure you'll spend the rest of the night awake under your covers, jumping at every creaking floorboard and afraid to look at the closet door lest see it move, this is your ticket. At $20 million to produce, the film was a major hit with $318 million worldwide making it one of the most profitable and highest grossing horror films in history. Number 2, The Babadook. With serious capacity to disturb viewers, it relies not just on monstrous terror, but also psychological terror of the most frightening sort. Some of the most unnerving and chilling moments are not of the creepy nature, but of the little boy as he seems to lose his mind or lashes out until his mother is losing hers. Amazingly, affected with very few literal traditional scares, it relies on tension and unsettling real life moments to make the darker parts all the more horrific. Budgeted at a low $2 million, the film pulled nearly $7 million in theaters and garnered widespread acclaim as one of the greatest modern horror releases. Number 1, Sinister. The film has been on my top horror list since its release, and it slowly made its way higher with each viewing. Now it finally sits where it was destined to, as the most horrifying. Disturbing, well acted, perfectly paced horror film, not just the last of the five years, but of the last decade. It's a true modern classic that joins the ranks of The Exorcist, Halloween, Psycho, and other iconic productions that constitute the best achievements of the genre. For the ultimate effect, watch this one as late as night as possible, with all the lights off and either alone or with just a small number of other people. This film grossed $77 million off of a $3 million budget, though it performed very well and had terrific profit margins. This brings us to the end of our video. I hope you got scared. Leave a like if you did or if you enjoyed the video and subscribe to our channel so you never miss out on any of our content in the future. We'll see you next time guys. Goodbye.